For this first one, you're going to need a red, green, blue, or black Leo, plain black skirt, and some pom-poms. For this next one, you're going to need green, blue, or purple metallic Leo. You'll also need a long blue or purple maxi skirt. For the makeup look, you'll need a green or blue eyeliner. I already had some on my eyelids, so I just kind of put some swirls on the outer corners of my eyes. You can kind of go for whatever look you want. I just went for some easy swirls. For the eyeshadow, just take a dark sparkly blue and lightly brush it over your eyeliner. Now take a lighter blue and put that on the bottom of your eyeliner. And then take a kind of neon green and put that on your eyelids. And then just do the same for the other eye. Next I just took some of the kind of lighter blue and mixed it with green and put it on my cheeks just to get kind of a shimmery mermaidish look. For hair, you could pretty much do whatever you want. You could do kind of beachy waves or something if you wanted. But I just decided to go for a simple braid. It was kind of like a Dutch-ish braid. Um, and then I just put it in a bun at the bottom and I thought it looked really cute. And here is the finished product and if you're a dork like me and you have a mermaid tail then you can put that on but it's really not very easy to walk in. For the third costume I just took these gray leggings you can pretty much use any color you want and this galaxy leotard. And now for the fun part which is makeup I just took this blush uh, it wasn't super bright but I ended up putting a lot of it on because if you want to get that 80s look, you have to have a lot of bright blush. Okay, so for eye makeup, I just took some of that dark blue that I used for my mermaid look and I got a lot of it on the brush. And then I applied it all over my eyelid and got it almost all the way up to my eyebrow. And then after that, I took some green, applied it to the outer corners of my eye, and just slightly above that dark blue eyeshadow. Hair was super easy. I just pulled it back into a high side ponytail, secured it with a scrunchie, and then kind of teased it a little bit to give it more poof. And there you go. Perfect 80s girl. For the last costume, you'll need a metallic Leo again and a tutu. For makeup, I kept the same 80s eye makeup and I really need to lighten my face a lot, so I just used my concealer, put it all over my face, and that really worked well. I ended up deciding that I was going to add on to my eye makeup, so I took kind of a plum color and added that to the outer corners and um, right under my eyebrow and then I took a hot pink and I applied that over the plum and then under my eyelids as well. To get the bright red nose I didn't have a clown nose so I just took some bright li red lipstick and I applied that to my nose and under my nose as well and then I applied some to my cheeks and rubbed that in to get kind of that like super bright clown look. To get the drawn on smile, I just put some red lipstick slightly above my lips and then drug it out to my cheeks and that made my smile look really wide and a little bit creepy. If you're like me and you don't have a clown wig, then just tease your hair. If you have any temporary hairspray, just spray some of that in. This is a completed look with the tutu. If you don't know how to make a tutu, 
There are tons of easy DIYs, or you can just tie some tulle around your waist.